The Short Park Crusaders fall for the third time in a row. This time it was a 5-2 defeat at the hands of the Spruce Grove Saints here tonight at the Short Park Arena. Hello everyone, I'm Taylor Medic with your post-game wrap. And the Spruce Grove Saints in the first of six meetings this season against the Crusaders really came out hard after the Crusaders getting an opportunity on the very first shift to get a goal past Saint goaltender Nolan Kent. It was basically all Spruce Grove throughout the hockey game. Crusaders inch closer a couple of times in the second period getting to within a goal courtesy of Tyler Pang early in the second period and then midway through the second period it was Merida Zitko getting his fifth of the year. The Crusaders got within one. Once again, that point it was 3-2, but the Saints just run away with things here at the Sherd Park Arena, winning this one 5-2. Big games from the likes of Chris Van Shaw getting a goal and three assists in this one for four points. Liam Freeborn, two goals and assists for the Spruce Grove Saints as well. You have Dylan Bourlet getting a multi-point game as well as Parker Soretsky. So lots to be happy about if you're the Spruce Grove Saints. If you're the Shirt Park Crusaders, a better outing for Sam Burford who got the start in goal. 40 saves on 45 shots for Burford. Nolan Kent, however, for the Spruce Grove Saints, a little bit better, only allowing two goals on 23 shots. He was solid. The Crusaders maybe did not test Kent enough here tonight against the Spruce Grove Saints. Both teams a combined 0 for 5 on the power play, Crusaders over two, while the Saints were over three. It was thought after the Crusaders killed off a five on three in the first period against the Saints, that could provide momentum. Unfortunately, it did not. Both teams look ahead to the AJHL showcase this weekend in Camrose. The Crusaders, they get the Canmore Eagles Thursday night at the Max McLean Arena in Camrose as well on Saturday. Back to the Max again for the Crusaders. They'll come back home Friday or Thursday rather, and rest Friday, and back on the road Saturday to take on the Olds Grizzlies to wrap up the AJHL Showcase Weekend.